Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare says there are six cases of the Omicron variant in Leon County. And while some are concerned, many people aren't letting that stop their holiday travel plans. ABC's 27 Shanice Archer has more. Hassey International Airport is seeing an increase of travelers similar to pre-COVID numbers back in 2019. Uh, this is great to see, um, especially during this time of year. I mean, it's so touching to see families coming out that haven't seen each other in a while. Over the pandemic, it was difficult for loved ones to see each other, and traveling wasn't an option. Derwin says having this increase in travel brings him joy. It's one of the things I love about working at an airport. Airports are very emotional places where there's a lot of emotions for people flying out or coming in. With COVID concerns remaining high, Derwin says the Tallahassee Airport has COVID safety protocols in place. Tuesday, Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare confirming six Omicron variant cases in Leon County. Emergency healthcare physician Alex Ho says they are prepared. I think that it's, it's expected. We, uh, we know that the virus transmits um, easily amongst the population. It was just a matter of time before it gets detected in our community and in the states. Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare also recommends everyone to get tested if they are traveling and if they're unvaccinated to be careful. In Tallahassee, Shanice Archer, ABC 27. And Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare does recommend that everyone get vaccinated and those who aren't do have a higher risk of getting sick.